welcome or welcome back to another vlog. If you're new here, hi, my name is Fab. Welcome and happy Sunday. Yes, I am wearing the same outfit from the last vlog because I decided to start a new vlog today. So let's get this started, y'all. I am in the kitchen, obviously. I am about to make baked ravioli. So I picked up two bags of the ravioli. All right, I am going to add ground turkey, a little bit of chicken sausage. Y'all know this is my favorite chicken sausage. It has a nice little spicy taste to it. So I'm gonna add that, a little bit of onion, some mozzarella. I end up picking up this ragu, this Simply Ragu, never tried it. So this is going to be our first time. And also the ragu kettle. I kind of want to make my sauce from scratch, but I'm not doing that because I'm supposed to be finishing up my closet, not all the way, halfway with hubby later. So I needed something quick to make. I got the chicken sausage cooking right now. What else did I pick up? Um, and baby, oh, Lenny, oh, Lenny got her Claritin here. Well, <laughs> the off-brand Claritin. While well, this pollen, it seems like She's having some type of, her allergies are acting up lately. So we had to get her more of that. And our baby I'm putting in this aluminum foil pan. Tired of washing dishes, so this, hopefully I'll be able to make one pan because I don't have a lot of turkey and I just have a little bit of chicken sausage. So they better be happy with that. But I am going to season some meat. I am trying to do a little bit better when it comes to that. Maybe on Sundays, I may, <laughs> yeah, I mean, may, I may try to cook two meals or maybe just have one ready for the following day so I don't have to season it actually the day of or the day before I cook. So if I have that season, I could, you know, cook probably on Tuesday or something like that. I don't know. I used to cook two meals on Sundays before, but then, you know, I already know life. Life be, life be happening. Y'all know, y'all already know life be happening. But welcome, if you're new here, we're here to have a good time, but this is my life. So welcome again. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. You know your girl, but you truly appreciate it. And turn your notification on so you don't miss out on your girl because we are growing and glowing over here. The slay babes, that is. So yeah. So hopefully it takes me about a good hour to make all this. And then I go upstairs and do what I need to do. But I do need to cut up the onions. But I wanted to start the vlog for today before I forget and get all caught up. You already know, I always have everything out on my counter. So I'm not gonna show you all that. It looks like a mess, but this is what I do. I have to have everything out. So I know what I need to add in there. If I need to add something else, I'll just pull it out. But I got mostly everything out and it's looking crazy. It's looking crazy. So I need to finish it up. Cause like I said, there's nowhere to sit. There's nowhere to sit. Woo child, this is feeling real empty right now. Real empty. <laughs> Lord. Mm, 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 mm. You know what? I don't even know what we're going to do with this because they kept bringing me this water, even so I'm paying for it. So I'm not too sure what we're gonna do. I'm just gonna leave it like that. I was gonna say something and slip because y'all know I'll be snitching, but I'm not gonna snitch on myself. I'm really not gonna snitch on myself. Yeah, yeah. Whew. All right, what else do I have here that I want to show you all? Oh. I actually finally got my pre-workout powder here. I didn't try it yet, but I will definitely let you guys know how it is when I try whenever I go <laughs> workout. I didn't go workout last week because I'm always slacking like always. I need to do better when it comes to that. Well, my son right here, look at him. He, he trying to go real slow right now. I'm not trying to make no noise. <laughs> Like I was saying, sorry about that. Um, I'm just like really thinking how I haven't been to the gym. Yeah, this is, this is my life, the struggles. It's just, I'm really trying to fit everything in my schedule. That's, that's, that's the best way I could describe it. The 
with this month, you know, I told you all it's going to be a busy month for us. And I'm trying to make sure I work out, vlog, cook, do what we need to do all in a short period of time. I still have to go to work. I could take some days off, but I'm kind of trying to wait uh, probably next month. Even so I took, you know, the two days, but I really wanted to relax. I really needed a day off, but that didn't really happen. I just had a day off of not working, but I didn't really get to relax and do nothing. Then that's what I really wanted to do. Even so yesterday, what did we do yesterday? We did all that running around. Took London to practice. Like I said in the last vlog, took her to practice, took her to a friend house. And today we picked her up and... After we went to the grocery store today, now I'm on something else. After we went to the grocery store, she wanted um, to go to the beauty supply store to pick up um, some new shampoo and conditioner for her hair. She was taking her, actually taking her hair out and she wants me to dye her hair. But I said, honey, I can't do that today. I got to finish cooking and I need to start on my closet. These kids, they don't understand like all this moving around and doing all this. I am not a young teen. I got to take a little break and I can't do all three of those today. No, no. It is 728 right now, y'all. Look at this. So by the time I'm done cooking, it may be like eight o'clock. I have to cook everything on the stove, the turkey. I, like I said, I have the chicken cooking, the ravioli. All I need to do is mix everything up and put it in that pan and put it in the oven and I should be good. But these kids do not understand and Hubby does not either. He's not gonna give me a break. He is not gonna give me a break. He always, always got me doing something y'all. I don't get it. I do not get it. Look, I'm dropping stuff like always. Whew, he don't get it y'all. He really doesn't. And then earlier we went to um, TJ Maxx because I was looking and I said, I'm going to stop going outside and spending money and I end up spending money, but I had to buy, you know, groceries. Obviously we have to eat, but I don't know why I went to TJ Maxx. I had this set in my mind to pick up some of these Korean products. Y'all know I love Korean products. It's like, I kept seeing it on, I think TikTok. For a person that don't be on TikTok, I sure be seeing things, huh? I'm like, I always go to TJ Maxx and I notice it, but I really don't try any of the new products I see there. I tend to go to the ones that I know, but maybe I don't know what was up with me. And I went to TJ Maxx and bought a few things, but not really. Yeah, I already know. I got a shopping problem. I'm sorry if I'm always, always have a haul to show you all, but this is me. I shop. I shop. I'm not buying no clothes. Oh, let me get back to buy my clothes. My birthday coming up. I don't even know what I'm doing for my birthday. It look like I ain't doing nothing. And I thought I was going to do something. Mm -mm. <sighs> yeah. So I picked up this collagen matcha. My mom and I were just talking about collagen and stuff like that. And I ended up picking this up from TJ Maxx. I'm trying to make sure that is focusing here on it. And yeah, I know I love me some matcha. So hopefully this tastes good. It says you just need to add it with um, juice, water, or any beverage you like. So I'm not gonna add it with juice. I'm gonna try it out with water first and see how that works out. So hopefully it tastes good. So I picked that up and I picked up some other things that ain't important right now because I need to cook, it ain't important. But I just want to show you all this. And it was $9.99. Let me check out my food. Yes, I know we have two different shapes of ravioli. 
But that's what hubby wanted, and that's what I'm gonna give him. That's what he wants. Do y'all season y'all um, spaghetti sauce? I tend to. I always season it up just a little bit. And also, I always add, for some reason, I always add Parmesan cheese to it. Give it a good taste, y'all. Try it out. All right, y'all, I am holding my pocket three and it's about to die and I want to show you all the final look of the baked ravioli before everybody dig in. It is a Friday, so happy Friday. So the last time I recorded was on Sunday when I made the baked ravioli. I really thought I was gonna be able to do a weekly vlog, but that didn't happen. So hopefully you all enjoyed me cooking my baked ravioli was so good. I know I have a lot of so mommy subscribers that enjoy cooking. So hopefully you all enjoy that. I know I like to make a quick meal when I can, so I just want to share that with you all, but that weekly vlog did not happen. Cause today is Friday, it didn't happen. Just got a lot going on in a good way, so I was not able to record. I said, let me go ahead and just add Sunday to this weekend vlog, cause baby, it ain't happening, it ain't happening, it ain't happening. So I'm about to get ready, actually, I had an appointment yesterday, to get my eyes checked. So hubby in London went yesterday. I had this long, long meeting yesterday that lasted about four hours. We took a break and came, <laughs> how is it that when it comes to me? We took a break and came back and it was just so much. I was so drained from that meeting. And I think I told you all, I'm a type of person. I say how I feel and during the meeting, I was like, whoo, damn, this is a long meeting. This is a long meeting, boy. It was like, yeah, we have to go over everything, you know, changes that they are thinking about doing and you know how they want everything to be going forward. So it was a long meeting. I was, I came back home, I told hubby, I'm like, it was so long that I missed my appointment yesterday. So they went, so he actually was able to reschedule it for me for today at two o'clock is 117, so I'm not gonna talk too much, but I wanted to start my vlog right now since I was slacking with the so-called weekly vlog. So we'll see about my eye, because I think I said it on one of my vlogs that I feel like my eyes are kind of getting worse. So I was, I don't know, and the reason why I say I was, I was thinking about, I'm not too sure that's why I'm saying that again. If I should get contacts or not. I'm not too sure. Y'all know I wear a lash extension, so that might be an issue. But I will ask the doctor about that, of me trying to put them on. And it's been a long time. And y'all know I always bring stuff up like this because, you know, I'm older. I remember in middle school, I wanted hazel contact. Everybody was getting color contacts back then. Do y'all remember that? Or it was just something in my Miami that was going on. So I begged my mom for some hazel contacts. I didn't need it then. I had 2020 vision then. Here's a problem now. It's a problem now as I got older. And I remember I begged her for it and then um, there were some, you know, some girls I was hanging around with at the time. They got some, you know, we thought we was an ish back then. I was like, oh, I got me some color eyes. I look so good, child. I was just feeling myself back then. So it's been a while since I even put contacts on. So I'm trying to think here, will it work out with my lash extension? Will I be able to put them on? So those are two things, um, two concerns I have about that. Love this sunscreen, just got it. Got to put that out there right now. So, I, I don't know, we'll see. And I'm gonna check out the glasses. Hubby said he didn't see any that I will like. So we'll see about that. If not, I'll just go somewhere else when it comes to my glasses. I know we get an allowance for, I think 150, but let me tell you, tell you all, 150 is really not that much. Well, you know what, for me it's not, okay? For me, it's not because I tend to get, you know, my little luxury glasses, you know, so they're usually what, like three, four hundred dollars. And I know it looks crazy right now, y'all, but give me a second. Hold on, take this off. Oh, because we got to go. It's, uh, it costs. 
a little to get those type of glasses. So I don't know. I know I got a few things to pay. I don't pay hubby no mind tomorrow. I don't pay no bills. Probably not as much, but I pay something, okay? And just got some stuff going on there that I need to pay and get that situated. So I don't know if I'm going to get any glasses or not right now. We'll, we'll see when we get there. We'll see. I really, and I'm not going to lie, I always gravitate to either some Gucci or Fendi or whatever glasses. Call it what you want. I'm just being honest of what I look at because those glasses be looking nice. Not saying now because they are, you know, that they look good. It's just something I gravitate to. There are, you know, glasses that are cheaper that look good as well. But I'm just saying what I do. Okay? I what I'm saying. What I do. So we're going to see about that. Hopefully I'm not there for too long. I have to pick up Lundy. Lundy. <laughs> That's what hubby called London. I got to pick a London up from school and I don't know if hubby is going to be done what he's doing to pick her up so I should be that on right because let me get out square 415 so I should be good and it's not far from it's not far from where she you know school she goes to so I should be good but look at the look at the sunscreen y'all see it it blends so good in the skin at first I was scared but it, it's good, y'all. It's good. I had to put my hair up. You know, like my hair touching me or nothing like that. Touching my shoulder. Shower and getting ready. I got to put it up a little bit. So, yeah. So, that's the plan for today. Pick up London. I know London wants me to re-dye her hair again. Because she took her hair out the other day. So, now she wants to... She wants me to dye it, y'all. What am I talking about? She just wants me to die. I'm get some water. <sighs> she wants me to die, and she has a volleyball tournament again tomorrow. I think we have one more, the championship game, and I think that's it for the summer. I'm just ready for that part to be over. So, you know, mommies need a break, too. We need a break, too, from all that back and forth, being a taxi driver all the time. I need a little break. So yesterday, after that long draining meeting, I came home, relaxed for a little bit, and I had to take her to practice. Cause y'all know Thursday's my day and hubby is not gonna do it. Only time he's really gonna do it if I'm sick. If I'm dying out here, he'll take her. But I had no reason for him to take her. I was like, okay, Lonnie, let's just go. Let's just go. And I just sat in the car and watched a few vlogs cause he was ain't gonna do it. He was ain't gonna do it. So, whew. I need to get all that, that's what I'm getting at. I just need to get all that situated, get her ready for tomorrow. Just need a break from all those practices. And we gotta figure out what she's gonna do for the summer because she ain't gonna be staying home doing nothing. Mm -mm. So how y'all doing y'all? How y'all doing? Comment down below, comment down below. All right y'all, that's enough talking. It is 1.23. Let me finish up here and go. See you all. As you get older, your body changes. I knew that, but now that I'm over 40, it's kind of hitting me. You know, I'm like, damn, I remember when I had 2020 vision with no issues whatsoever, and my eyes started bothering me probably in my 30s I noticed my eyes was bothering me I'm like what is going on with my eyes because I thought I was gonna have 20-20 vision for all my life right I wasn't thinking about that now that I went to my appointment the doctor was telling me I need progressive glasses oh my progressive glasses got me sounding real old now what is that you know I know sometimes I can't I can't read like small prints like this right here is a struggle for me to read. I know that. He's like, yeah, you're gonna need it for, you know, far away. And then if you need to read up close, that's why I need progressive glasses or whatever. I'm like, yo, when he was telling me all this, I think my mind went blank for a second. Like I was listening, but not really listening. I'm like, what is going on here? It, like it really hit me. I'm like, what? 
what? I said, what about contacts? He's like, oh, if you get contacts, you're still going to need your reading glasses. I'm like, okay, that's actually spending more money. So he's like, you either could get, you know, just regular glasses or progressive. What was the other, other word he used? I'm not too sure, y'all. My, my mind was just like in shock, okay, in shock. I wanted to show you all the glasses I was looking at, but then the guy came by and started talking to me and showing me different styles. So I turned the camera off because he was like, uh, Fabian, Fabian, yelling out Fabian, Fabian. I'm like, I'm right here, I'm right here, trying to record. And I was like, you know what, let me just shut this off. I'm just gonna have to share with you all the ones I'm thinking about. The ones, the one I'm thinking, but he also told me they will be having a sale the second week of May. So I may just go back for that so I can get them, you know, for good price because we ain't spending that much right now. You know, so we can get that allowance for 150. I'll probably have to come out of pocket about two something like I always do. I didn't take no good pictures, y'all. I was just over it, I think. <laughs> I was in shock. But these right here, what kind? Okay, these were Gucci. I like the color. Well, this was okay. A little boring. The guy was like, no, you don't need no boring glasses. Let's get something more fun. I'm like, I'm okay with fun. But it got to fit my face. I do like the cat eye um, shape. Are these are cat eye. These were a little boring, child. I was just, I don't know. Then I had a good selection this time. Ooh, let me not zoom in because I'm looking crazy. They really didn't. They usually do, but this time they didn't. I don't know, y'all. So I'll see. I'll, I'll see about that. I'll just wait um, about that. I'm just happy I went. So my prescription changed just a little bit, he said. So I do have... Um, my prescription here with me. So I, if I want to go somewhere else, I'll be able to because I have my um, my prescription. So he was saying my eyes are dry. So he did recommend, I have it in my purse, um, some drops that I should put in my eyes for two months. I'm like, oh, okay, my eyes dry. I don't feel it, but okay. And then he was asking me, um, do I get headaches often? And I was like, no, I get migraines here and there, but nothing like that. He was like, oh, okay. So he's like, if, if I get them often, then it could be some type of, of course, when I do get migraines, I do feel a pressure by my eyes. So he said, if it's often, then, you know, it could be caused by, you know, my eyes or whatever, child, whatever. So I just wanted to share that with you all. I'm about to go pick up London. I had to rush when I left my appointment to finish with work because I'm that type of person. I have to finish what I started so I could work on something else that's, I don't know. I'm gonna say it's OCD or whatever y'all wanna call it. I just don't like to turn in work late. I like to get it done and move on to the next one. And I'll be busy at work, y'all. I'll be busy at work. So right now it's 4.11. Let me head to pick up London and wait in that long line to pick her up and we'll go from there. So I'll see you all later. All right. 15 minutes. 15 minutes. I'm gonna put a dark shirt on because last time it fell, right, London, on the yes, floor? It fell on the floor. Let's okay. move this carpet just to... Yeah, let's move the little rugs off the floor. So I don't know why she trusts me with this again. Because my father won't be able to do it. Huh? Because you won't be able to do it? No, my father Your father? Look at her. Daddy's girl. Hold on, let me angle, angle you all just a little bit better. I don't have my mic on right now. I didn't want to get it all dirty. So London picked up cinnamon and intense red to mix up. Let me make sure I've noticed lately it's not focusing on the products I show on here. I'm not too sure why I got to check and see because I didn't change anything. I mean, the setting wise on my pocket three. So I'm not too sure why it's doing that. So let's see. Maybe I need to wait. Cause how long I had this pocket three? Since December? Yeah, so since December, I didn't have no issues, but lately I noticed that. So I guess we're gonna mix this up. We're doing the, what's it called?
all again? Child, I never know, child. Skunk stripe? Skunk stripe all over again. Let me pull this hair up. You trust me? I see that's my favorite dance. Mm, mm. I hope I get my... I hope it don't fall on my jeans. It's not gonna fall. Yeah, I know I don't be wearing jeans like that. I do need to buy me some new jeans though. So, it's hard for me to find jeans that fit me right for the curvy girls. Curvy girls, uh, curvy girls, uh. <laughs> Can y'all see little face? Let's just start, let's die in the front. You wanna start in the front? Yes, cause we died. Look at her direct to me what to do. Cause you remember last time we didn't have much for the back. No, we didn't have much. Well, we have two bottles, London. You should have, you'll have enough for um for the front and the back. Okay, guys, so. Is that, did you part it right? Just be acting like they know more than you. I know, hold on. I know, I don't know how to do hair. We know that, we all know that. But for you to part your hair like that. I'm trying to get all the pieces. London, you can add a little bit more to it. It needs to be a straight part. That's okay. We're gonna. Oh, okay. So you just try. Oh. Yeah, I'm trying to get all the pieces. I'm just gonna go over it later. We're gonna see how this comes out. <laughs> she better not cry. She better not complain. Because y'all see what time it is? 7.50. And you still gotta do my bun. I'm not doing no bun right now. Yes, mom. I'm not doing a no bun. And she's talking about she want a bun. Y'all see how much she trusts me in a bunch out. We got to spend that little time. No, you I'm need to go to bed. I'm going to see bed at 9.30. At 9.30. It's about to be 8 o'clock, London. That is a process. Okay, we're okay? going to do this part next. I do not have all day. Okay? I do not have all day to do this with you. I'm not going to be up all night trying to dye some hair, which could have waited till tomorrow. Or, I mean, not tomorrow because she has this tournament tomorrow. For Sunday. Oh, no, child. I got Sunday fun day coming up, child. <laughs> which I shouldn't be going, but I'm going. It's a celebration! It is too bright. Okay, and London is not thinking about how we did not add the bleach to her hair again. So of course her roots are black and then the ends is like that blondish color. So I'm looking at her hair right now. So it is kind of bright, but it's not too bad. You already know, I want her to look her age. I didn't think it looked bad because it's just a little bit of it. You know what I mean? And she always have her hair out. So I think it'd be cute, but she wants to calm it down a little bit. So we're gonna add the cinnamon to it and she was like daddy's gonna say something because <laughs> she know he didn't like it the first time right he didn't like it the first time we did it yeah he didn't like it. he's like oh why are you doing all that so to avoid any heated conversation later because he's not here yet we're gonna go ahead and color it again and she doesn't like it too as well she feel like it's too bright so she's parting her hair right now i'm looking at her so we could try that again. Just finished cleaning the kitchen. I really got to clean up the tub because now it's kind of red. Get my clothes out. London needs to get ready too. You got your stuff? What are you washing? That's not me that's washing. Who's washing? Oh, I was washing clothes. Okay. Do you need to wash anything? No, I don't think so. Okay. So we need to finish this up so she could get her bag ready. And what else do we need to do tonight? Mm, that's about it. So right now it is, I got my phone on the charger, child. My phone's on the charger. Whatever time it is, it's probably about eight something. And London says she's going to sleep at nine. <laughs> yeah, right. Because we have to be there tomorrow at seven. I told y'all that's another damn job at seven. So she needs to go to bed at a decent time. So I will show you all probably tomorrow her hair. If not tomorrow, then um, on Sunday. So we're just going to do it like that. So good night.
right, y'all, I am back and happy Sunday. So today is Sunday fun day. I am about to go to lunch with a Tara and Shannon. And then we probably hit up a, probably a bar or something like that. I guess we like Mexican food. Because if y'all remember a couple of weeks ago when we went out, we went to a Mexican restaurant and we actually go into another one. But this one is not as fancy as the other one. So this one is very chill. I am halfway ready. I got my bodysuit on. My pants is on the bed. Y'all know me and my little two-piece. Can never go wrong with a two-piece. For real. Can never go wrong with that. So, <laughs> hubby, I gotta laugh first, y'all. Hold up. Hubby is kind of upset with me. I guess he had plans for us to hang out today, but he didn't tell me that till yesterday. And I totally forgot to tell him that I made plans with them. I am a planner. I cannot do anything last minute. So I think Tara and I planned this since, and Shannon, I think we planned this since Tuesday or Wednesday or something like that. I was like, oh, you know, I'm free on Sunday. Um, Saturday, I can't go because, you know, London volleyball tournament. So we plan for Sunday, but I really didn't know he oh. um, <laughs> fell. Hold on. Let me fix this a little. Oh, Lord. Oh, here. Okay. Sorry. So, yeah, like I was saying, I didn't know he wanted to do something. So he was kind of upset about that. He's like, oh, you didn't tell me. And I didn't. That was my fault when it comes to that. I know he didn't say anything before. So I was like, okay, cool. I'm going to go ahead and go out Sunday, but I shouldn't have told him after I made those plans or asked him because he usually do is um, if he's going out with his friends or whatever, he'll text me if we're not around and ask me, you know, um, do we have plans Saturday or do we do you have any plans? And we'll go from there. But I didn't do that because I know he's really not trying to do anything. I was thinking. So I'm like, OK, he should be OK with me going out Sunday. The thing is, I just didn't tell him until yesterday. So. I know. So I went ahead and this is very, I'm being honest. I said, you know what? Let me go ahead and do the laundry. <laughs> well, I mean, that's something I always do, but let me do it ahead of time. Laundry. I made us some, um, I saw online the seafood, the seafood boil ramen. So I made that for us yesterday. And so he won't be that mad at me. I know, I know, I know this is a work in progress when it comes to that. I know y'all, but at least, you know, one thing about me, I am going to take care of home first. If there's times when I don't do that because I'm just not in the mood because I always, you know, cook what he likes and do what I need to do. There's times I'm going to be tired. And I'm like, okay, I'll just do it the following day, which I don't feel like that's an issue. Let me stop. Let me start doing this, which I don't feel like that's an issue. Just don't have nothing in here. So there's times that's going to happen. And there's times that I am going to do it. So just to be on his good side, and I'm not lying, I said, let me go ahead and make him something that he would like. And it was my first time making that um, seafood boil, and he actually liked it. And he left for today. Well, not left for today. He went out for a little bit. He should be back. So I went ahead and fixed his bowl for him. <laughs> so he don't be too bad at me. He's still going to be bad at me. He's still going to be bad at me. I know he is, honey. I know he is, but I'm a planner. Like we typically plan things, you know, when it comes to everything, he gonna plan the day before it. I didn't, like I said, I really didn't think he was gonna do anything. Cause we went out, ooh, we went out last weekend and he had this whole spill. How are we not gonna do anything? So I didn't even, I didn't even, I didn't even think about it. I didn't, I think we was gonna do like a little family thing today, but we could do it another time. Can you hear me? We could do it another time. But he already know I always plan things like when it comes to um, just the other day, someone hit me up and asked me to go out to dinner on Thursday. And I don't think that person, I don't think this person watched my um, vlog and a lot of people I know don't really watch my vlog. No shade, but shade to people that know me don't watch my vlog. It is okay. But anyways, there's nothing against what this person I'm just saying um, she invited me out for dinner and I know, you know, Thursdays are my days to take London to volleyball practice. I'm not going to skip my responsibility to go out. I just, at my age, I don't need to be, I'm not doing that. Maybe when I was younger, you know, I was so hot and ready to hang out. I'm not hot and ready. I've done a lot. 
You know what I mean? I, yeah, I still have a good time, but it's not that serious to me. And I really don't go out on the weekday. <laughs> I used to do that in my 20s, going out on the weekday. Only time I really do that, if I'm going, if I'm off or it's a holiday, that's when I usually do it. Or I know I don't have that much work to do the following day, then I may. It depends. I may. But at this age, I really don't do it as often. So, and I'm spraying, what is this? This rice water, you know, they say you got to keep your hair hydrated. So I've been, been doing this. Y'all know I've been using this before but I've been using it a little bit more with these locks. So that's why I'm just spraying. I should be good. I'm gonna put a little bit of makeup on and I should be good. And I don't have no lashes. <laughs> so I wanna put some lashes, my lashes, the little strips. It's been a while, so I don't even know if I know how to do that. I don't even know how to do that, so yeah. So hopefully, back to that really quick and I'm done with that topic. <sighs> I hope he's not too bad when I get back. He ain't too bad. He ain't too mad. He, he's over it. He, he's over it. I just know I can't do that again. You know, got to compromise and know when you do something wrong, admit to it. And I did admit to it. I was wrong. I was like, yeah, you're right. I, I was wrong for that. So I got to do better when it comes to when it comes to that. I tend to do that, but I just get caught up with everything else. And I just assume things which I shouldn't assume. And, you know, hubby and I, we talk about everything. That's, that's my partner. Yeah, of course I know that's my partner, but like, you know, we talk about a lot of things. We truly, truly do. So that slipped my mind. And it helped me be kind of jealous too, y'all. He be kind of jealous when it's time for me to go hang out. Now I didn't like he's insecure or anything, so I don't need nobody thinking that because people be reading into things too much. It's not that serious, y'all. But he be a little, he be a little jealous. Like, oh, you ain't gonna have a good time without me. That's 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 his issue right here. <clears throat> All right. Ooh, I can't do it too tight. Ain't gonna have no more edges. London! I wanna show you all London's hair, child. I'm over that the conversation. I know hope you don't watch my vlog, so I can talk about it. So yesterday, I, there's really nothing in here. Yesterday I did London's hair. Baby, it was a struggle doing her hair. Let me show you all really quick. London! Let them see your hair. Let them see your hair. Let the slay babes, the slay babes see your hair. Ooh. Stop saying that. Your head is not big, okay? Stop saying that. When I was doing her hair yesterday, she was like, oh, my head is so big. No, no, it's not. You're beautiful. No, no, no. No, it's not. It's, it's okay. So you don't walk around with that in your brain thinking your head is big. It is a head. It's average. I don't know how long it's gonna last, but we'll see. I mean, I sprayed that baby down with, um, what was it, got to be? Got to be. Got to be? Got to be. Okay. I sprayed that thing down. Yeah, her talking about her head big. I know, girl, I'm gonna sit down somewhere with that. Her head is not big. These kids, I don't want her to walk around feeling insecure about nothing, okay? No, mm-mm. You're fine how you are. Don't, mm -mm. so once she start thinking that and someone say, oh, your head big, she really gonna have some type of <clears throat> insecurity about it. Nah, we ain't about to do that. No, no. So if someone says something to you, you know to brush it off. Let me go, y'all, because I need to put some makeup on. Y'all know I'm slow. Mm. I was gonna show y'all that part, but y'all probably tired of seeing me put my makeup on. I know there's a few whew, that enjoy watching me put my makeup on, but thirsty i'll just show you all the final look how about that that's what we're gonna do okay i'll see y'all this is the outfit i'm wearing i feel like i'm rushing right now like always i thought the place was 30 minutes away but it's saying it's 40 minutes so i'm probably gonna have to call them and let them know that i'm gonna be late but anyways this is my comfortable little two-piece but i just feel like this part right here my breast area might pop out or something this is super comfortable. Let me zoom in a little bit. Okay. It is comfortable. And I just, just wear my little sandals. So this is the face right here. Why well, I just keep trying to zoom in? Okay. Hopefully y'all could, you know what? The lighting, y'all. The lighting. The lighting. But yeah. 
Did a quick beat. Oh, that's probably tear random. All right, y'all. I'll see you all at the restaurant. And we'll just go from there. Sunday fun day is over. It is probably about 10 o'clock right now. I probably would have been here a little bit earlier, but there was traffic. There's always traffic in Atlanta for some reason. It's ridiculous. I would have been here earlier. And also I was chit chatting with my mom and my sister on FaceTime. And then I was also chatting with hubby before I came in the bathroom because I need to go ahead and wash my face. Take all of this off, y'all. And so <clears throat> it took a little minute. So anyways, I am so happy that we went out earlier and I love going out a little bit earlier. I don't mind going out at night, but I do enjoy a good day activity. I enjoy going out for lunch in a little bar and then coming, coming back home at a decent time. It just works out for me. Who, who else is like that? It just works out better when it comes to that. So now I just get to, you know, wash my face, relax and get ready for the next day. You know what I mean? So it works out for me. So that taco spot we went to was pretty good. The food was very reasonable compared to the other one we went to. I guess that was more like, you know, gourmet, fancy compared to what we went to. The drinks there are really good. Then we end up going to a lounge for a little bit. Actually, the lounge that we picked, that was so funny. The lounge that we picked was right down the street. So we didn't have to move our car or anything like that. If you live in Atlanta, you know how it is when it comes to parking. And we actually went to Midtown. It's kind of hard finding parking over there. So I'm happy we didn't have to move our car to go somewhere else. So that part, that part worked out well for us. We chilled over there, had a little bit more drinks over there and you know, a little snack or whatever, chit chat. And that is it. You know, I had a little girl time. Sometimes you need a little girl time, you know, to have another woman. You know, I'm always talking to hubby or my mom or something like that. So it was cool chit-chatting with them, you know. So we had a great so time. I appreciate you all for watching. And I don't want to keep running my mouth right now because this is not the time to be running my mouth. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. You know your girl, but truly, truly appreciate it. And turn your notification on so you don't miss out on your girl because we are growing and glowing over here. Listen, y'all, is my lashes on properly? I feel like this was not on. I had to say that. <laughs> Just in case y'all saw that. Just in case. I know. It's been a while. I know. <clears throat> so you'll miss out on your girl. Y'all see how I stopped and went right back to that part? Damn, I'm good, y'all. Yeah, but I know I said that part. Because we are growing and glowing over here. The slave babes, that is. Don't mind me, y'all. It's time to go to bed. I am tired. And like I always say, until next time.